Wakaeteni buga ni yuko nsopti English Practice and Progress. Salamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Welcome back to English with Sussman official channel. Passage 38 wa shaykadhi sobdun isididad e buga new concept in English practice and progress. Wa haywan kan naga everything except the way the wah walbo ama wah kasto marka laga rebo jowiga. By all the friends a hibki gadimiga Harrison had lived to hukunola in the Mediterranean. For many years, sanada badan ayu kunola bad the Mediterranean. Before he returned into Sankusolaban into England at Delka in Grisiga, he had often uhu badana dreamed of kuriyujri retiring in ukahol gabo ameskajujiu kashakainte in England at Delka in Grisiga. And I had planned uhu na korsha estate to settle down in udegu the country miga. He had no sooner returned than Markalo ego sit daxile muusan so lava karin he bought uhu gattay ama ibsaday a fine house guri fi'an and went uhu nadi to live there inu halka kunolado. Almost immediately, immediate, immediately, uhu da went islam marki va si aad uhu da almost wa very close to. Immediately islam marki va he began uhu bilaway to complain inu ka'awado about the weather during the atmosphere a specific time exactly for even though in casto it was still a really a hot summer summer it rained to hudaay continually wa in a continual manner hab is the joke is the joke regular alishan continually non stop and joke silen bu udaay rok and it was often badana and it was often badana bitterly called the si ad ay u qabooyay ama dhan wad after so many years another badan kadib of sunshine or ad ad ama qorrah harrison got a shock wound hay ama shock bu qaday he acted wuxu u dhaqmay as if he had never lived in us wiligis ba ku noolan in england dalka ingiriiska before hore in the end, the matki, it was more than he could bear. It was more than what a cabinet he could bear. In Uddul Khato, in Kabadan Bain Ottoman, he could bear. He had hardly had time. We could advocate in Uyesho Wakti to settle down, to get comfortable life. We could have a summer can all rahle. Alisham Masina Dravi. Disturbance at the head, settle down, you know, settle down, you know, or go, go, get comfortable, you know, when he sold the Merku Iskagade, the house Guriga, and left Unakategi, the country Miga Mabadihi, the dream really he had had Ulha, past the perfect tense, exactly using the word of his. Become his past perfect tense, but at least it's not had had. That can't be done. We could confuse girl and could just worry. But in what sentence he had had exactly? He had the Ulha for so many years. Another button in the day I'll come to the party. Harrison had thought of what he could figure everything well, but except the weather. But can't get rid of the weather. I want to ask you, Mr. Sonna, to solve it. Mashallah. Comprehension of fan can praise the Lord of God and answer the job of these questions is well in can not more than an accompanied in 60 words less than a read. Where Hage had the right to his friend, Koraga Sahibki Saharison Nikli that he spent Ukukati many years another badan. What did he want Mahu Donay to do in Usameyo? What did he buy Mahu Ipsede? Was the summer summer ka that ya sanat ka is very good ma ad bu ufi'na or was it bad misi wa uhuma? 
What did he complain about maha u ka'awday? Did Harrison sell the house Harrison miskaggade gurihi in the end damatki or not? Did he leave makatagi the country migi or not? Harrison not only but also is the joining word. Improve your pronunciation. Improve your pronunciation. Passage 38. Everything except the weather. Everything except the weather. My old friend Harrison had lived in the Mediterranean for many years before he returned to England. He had often dreamed of retiring in England and had planned to settle down in the country. He had no sooner returned than he bought a fine house and went to live there. Almost immediately he began to complain about the weather. For even though it was still summer, it rained continually and it was often bitterly cold. After so many years of sunshine, Harrison got a shock. He acted as if he had never lived in England before. In the end, it was more than he could bear. He had hardly had time to settle down when he sold the house and left the country. The dream he had had for so many years ended there. Harrison had thought of everything except the weather. Comprehension and praises. Answer these questions in not more than six words. Where had the writer's friend Harrison spent many years? What did he want to do? What did he buy? Was the summer that year very good or was it bad? What did he complain about? Did Harrison sell the house in the end or not? Did he leave the country or not? Thanks.